The Consumer Price Index report for July came out last hour. It's signaling inflation may have peaked, and that means prices should begin to level out, if not begin to drop in the coming months. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, the pace of consumer inflation has dropped to 8.5 percent. That's down from just over 9 in June, uh, largely due to the recent drop in gas prices. News Nation business contributor Lydia Moynihan is here right now. Lydia, what can you tell us about this report? Well, stocks are surging on this report. The Dow futures are up more than 400 points on this news. And this is really good news across the board. Not only is it a precipitous drop from last month, it's also much lower than what we expected. Um, commodity prices easing is really what's allowed inflation to come down. I also want to note core inflation, um, which is inflation except for energy and food, that is the number that the Federal Reserve looks at when they're thinking about raising interest rates. We expected that to be higher this month. It was not higher. It was the same as last month. So this is a really positive piece of data because it shows that what the Federal Reserve has been signaling and what they've been doing is working. And it means that peak inflation is now in the rearview mirror. Of course, this is still very elevated by historic standards, um, and it's still painful in the short term when you're going to the grocery store, but it means we're finally headed in the right direction. So that's obviously good news across the board. Personally and with the CPI, <laughs> it's a good thing. All right, thank you, Lydia. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.